Bergstresser trying to put up some points before halftime. Throws left side, and that one gets picked off as well. Dion Ballou is going to return this to the house. 10-5, touchdown. Crimson Tide continues to roll. Mizzou faithful strap in. This is going to be a long night. All right, Dane, you're going to run the offense this half. Get out there, make some plays, show me what you can do. Come on, get. All right, let's and go, guys. head coach Gary Pinkle has pulled Bergstresser. In Set. comes true freshman Red Dane 19. Whitaker to get his feet wet, get some Hut. reps, and see some real playing time. Hut. And his first snap will be a pass. Hut. Steps up, fires over the middle. First there completion, TJ Moe for a Hut. first down. Whitaker from the gun again, surveying the field. Throws right underneath to Lawrence, the halfback, and he'll pick up a gain of 10. They'll run the speed option to the left. Whitaker Ooh. takes a shot as he pitches it out to Lawrence, who will get enough for the first down and a sigh of relief hey. as Whitaker gets up. Play action on the jet uh. sweep. Whitaker takes another lick, but is able to get it out in time to Marcus Lucas, who gets stopped what? after a gain of six. Play action on third and four. Ah, Whitaker gets hit again as he throws, and the Tide have been getting their shots in. The Tigers will have to settle for three. McCarron on second and 12, and now Missouri is going off on Bama's quarterback. And A.J. McCarron is shaken up on the field. A reversal of misfortunes. Hi! Hi! Whitaker from the gun here on second and ten. Steps up. <coughs> Hit as he throws. Finds C.J. Moe on the post route with daylight in front of him. Yeah, 15, yeah. 10, and just like that, Missouri cuts the deficit to nine. How do you like that? Are we going for it? Let's go, let's go. And an early gamble 35, here for Mizzou as he'll go play. for two now tango, instead of tango. later. Whitaker yeah, barks out orders and takes the snap. <gasps> Fires over the middle, and that gets picked Shit. off. Sincere on the interception, and a two-possession game it will remain. And look who's back for more. A.J. McCarron trots back out on the field for the tie. He'll hand it off here on first and ten, and Eddie Lacy runs over a Tiger defender, breaks his way through some tackles, and picks up a first down. McCarron looking for a receiver. Rose to his left side, has Kevin Norwood open, hits him, and he'll streak his way down the sideline near the 30-yard line. McCarron a pass on third down. Pressure bearing on him, and they get to him. That will knock them out of field goal range, and McCarron is not happy. And all eyes are on Dane Whitaker. What will he do here? Throws over the middle. Scott Green Beckham crossing yeah, into enemy territory. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep First it moving. down, Tigers. Number six. <laughs> Whitaker to pass here on third and seven, looking to keep the Tigers alive. He's going to take off now. Picks up the first down, and he slides to the 15-yard line on, hurry, into hurry. the red zone. Back to the line. Reset, reset. And Missouri's going to run their hurry-up offense as we near two minutes to play in the final quarter of regulation. All right. Whitaker to throw again. Steps up and hits T.J. Moe. Oh, Two-point game. You could hear a pin drop in Tuscaloosa right now. Mizzou has three timeouts, and they have to keep Bama away from their own 35-yard line in order to have a shot. McCarron hands it off to Eddie Lacy, and he's going to make it tough on them already. A seven-yard gain. One more time to Lacy on third down. Straight up the gut. He's met by a gang he's of tacklers, short, yes, and he's just yes. short of the 35. Missouri stands. All right, and not even Dane Whitaker this. saw this coming. Potentially Goal, 41 seconds away from upsetting uh, the champion top. Hike. And here we go. Whitaker scrambling to his right. Looking for somebody. Tries to hit LaDamian Washington, but it's broken Hike. up. Whitaker. Scanning the field. Throws a fastball. Down Main Street. Scott Eric Waters. Yes. Way to go, Eric. Inside Bama's 30-yard line. And it comes down to the boot of Trey Barrow. Corbin Burke stressor to hold. Snap is clean. Kick is up for the win. We did it. We did it. Sweet home Alabama no more. Mizzou takes down the champ. Andre, welcome to your first dunk contest. Are you ready to find out your opponent for tonight? Yeah, I'm ready for anybody who walks through the... The champ is here! The champ is here! this party started here is andre crawford's first dunk of the day and it's but uh, oh it was under the legs but the crowd is not really feeling it let's see how the fans at home are reacting to andre and it pretty much is like the arena half asleep now on the court is rico and out of nowhere there's a car 
It appears he's gonna jump over it. If he jumps over this, it's over. We're going home, it's over. Okay, Kenny, it's gonna be over if he jumps over a vehicle that's not very tall at all. Got it. Here we go, full strides. Oh! Oh my goodness! The crowd is on its feet! The crowd doesn't know what to do! They are in shock of what they just saw over the car behind the back! The oh my goodness! What a dunk! But look at this! Behind the back! Opposite! Incredible to watch! On the other side of the court, here comes Andre Crawford with the under the legs! 360! Seems like we've seen it before, and the crowd is just let... The crowd not very not nice to Andre. They're very nice to Rico. He's clearly the bigger, badder, and better overall athlete and whatever he does in life. Because Rico was going up, and I see two balls, Kenny. I see two balls dangling in the air. What is he going to do? Oh, he windmilled it. He windmilled it. It's over. It's over, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go home. Timeout. He put a windmill through it. It's over. It's over! It's over, ladies and gentlemen! I know, Kenny. It is clearly over right now. I don't know what Andre could do, because the crowd, the fans, everybody is just in awe with what they just saw. Andre's gonna have to pull out another bag of tricks here, and he does another between the leg. That is uh, pretty nice. I would give it a solid six with what we've seen today from Rico. Andre really proved that he's not that athletic and not that great. Let's see how the crowd reacted. Yeah. All right, here's Rico on the final dunk, dangling from the rim. I don't know, what is he doing, Kenny? He's dang. Oh my, oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa. I'm trying to digest what I just saw, Kenny. It's over. Is it over, Kenny? It's over. I I I'm trying to think. He does dangling on the, he jumps. He, I have never seen this before in any dunk contest. Rico has the girth and the strength to throw the ball up and slam it down. The crowd just believed, it, it looks like they just saw a murder, Kenny. I, 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 I don't know what, how to explain what I just saw. I, I, Grandmas and grandpas and little black kids are just all over the world screaming of what they just saw. They don't know. Mouths are wide open. I think it's clear as day that Rico finished him off way too quick. And there will be no more Andre Crawford in dunk contests. Rico is your overall undisputed winner.